The sensors you deployed have picked up PAVN forces moving towards the base at Quezon, one of our primary surveillance outposts and a key jump-off point for future incursions into Laos. It is imperative that we retain this position. Infantry around the base has already been reinforced, but we need to bomb the enemy position ASAP or we face losing the base. The weather isn't ideal for it, but we cannot delay. You're going to have to rely on information from Battlefield Command to get the ordnance on target. Don't expect to get a good visual through all that cloud. Top secret. There are concerns that we may not be able to hold this position with conventional airstrikes. If this is the case, Command is seriously considering the use of tactical nuclear weapon. We cannot afford to lose this outpost. Visibility is poor. We can't get a visual on the target area. We need to relay bombing information from B-52 radar operator Terry Parker. MiG-21 incoming. We mustn't lose a single B-52. Intercept them. My dear, I read your last mail together with Zoe. 
She heard about the Mai Lei massacre on the radio, and they discussed it at school. She's asking some very hard questions. Like, why are you killing Vietnamese children? Aren't they just like she is? It was very difficult to stop her asking, since I certainly don't have the answers. Zoe wants to go on some of the marches that have been starting to get more and more popular. She says the people running the meetings are nice and easy to talk to. I said, I might take her if she's good and does her homework. Maybe she can find some answers from those people rather than worrying me with them. It's been a long time since your last leave. This war seems to have no end. It's not only lives that this war takes, but also families. I know you have your sense of duty, but Zoe has grown up now from the little girl who you used to bounce upon your knee. She is that girl no longer, but a young woman finding her way in the world. She barely knows you. Well, I hope you'll be able to come home soon for the holiday that you promised, and that I still recognize you. Be careful. Lisa and Zoe.